Hello, I'm uh, Justin Watson with Rosen Aviation, and we're here at AEA 2022. This is our booth. Behind me, we have our full range of production OLEDs, ranging in size from 22 to 55 inches. These are all-in-one, completely integrated units with a uh, power supply. Uh, we actually have an integrated variable frequency power supply, AC power supply for the 48 and 55 models, and then DC power supplies for our 22, 27, and 32. Um, we have HDMI, dual SDI, and fiber inputs. They're incredibly thin and light. They're under an inch thin. Um, I think we've got seven, eight, and nine pounds, respectively, so very, very sleek. And they're designed to go over existing holes. So if you're taking um, a display out of an aircraft, we can just put this right over the hole with no woodwork required, and you'll have this 3 8 thin bezel, um, and that'll be it. So how much does a 55 inch weigh? So for perspective, our previous 55 inch LCD was I think two and a quarter inches thick and over 50 pounds. Our OLED um, is just under an inch thin and weighs just 26 pounds. Wow, that's amazing. So what's the, uh, the newest gadget you have to show us here today? Well, we have something pretty exciting in addition to our OLEDs. This is our hologram controller uh, prototype unit. Um, you can see here, this is a fully functioning keypad that's representative of the microwave controller in our Maverick project uh, video. This is our vision for the cabin of the future. And all the technology in the Maverick project is based on real technology that's either in production or is adequately mature enough to go into a development project. And this is an example of that. Um, you can see here, uh, from the side, it looks like you're just kind of poking around in free space, but when you actually go to operate it, there's zero latency, um, very high definition image. And this is something that's touchless, hygienic, and really has that wow factor as well. So it looks like it's just kind of floating in midair. Yeah, that's correct. Um, it's The technology is really in the glass. It reflects your source image, which could be really anything. Um, out at 45 degree angle, uh, out in free space. So, uh, do, do you have any customers that have spec this yet or are you talking to them? Yeah, we have a lot of interest in this. Um, the, the good thing about it is that the projected image is gonna be 7 eighths of your source display or whatever your source is. Um, so the size of the box can range from you know, one by four for a faucet slider that does temperature and flow control uh, all the way up to something like a full size keypad. And we can imagine it actually kind of rotated around like this and flush in a countertop, let's say, and now we just have this keypad coming out of nowhere. I think that's uh, a very important part of what our methodology is and our thought process for our products is we want to build technology that's there when you need it and largely invisible when you don't. I know the designers for many years have been hindered by bezels and clunky switches and all these things and we want to create an environment that's integrated and smart and also very aesthetically pleasing. And so a lot of these technologies can help us do that.